Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So, we finished The Sims busting out last week as part of our Retro Sunday series and now we're carrying it on and moving on to the next game in the franchise which is The Sims 2 on PlayStation. I can't tell you how excited I am about playing this game. I haven't played it since I think when it came out, I think I got it for Christmas that year. I don't remember if I completed it or how far along the game I got, but I did love it very much. I think this was the first game, even though I had played The Sims 1 and I played Bustin' Out on console, I was a bit too young to really understand like how to play it properly. My Sims just kept dying and stuff. This game I think was the first game I played where I kind of knew what I was doing. <laughs> So this might be, this might be my favorite console game. Okay, here we go. All right, we're gonna go story mode, continue game, start new game. Maybe that continue game comes up every time and then it will just tell me there's nothing there because I haven't started a game yet. I'm excited to see what houses we're gonna live in, what quests we will complete and what friends we'll meet along the way. Okay, I guess this is me. What kind of hair we got going on then? Oh, this one's quite nice. I don't think I'm going to go for that one though, because that's the one you get in the PC version as well, and I want to try something new. This one's all right. Let's go for this one. Not many color options. Let's go for this. Accessories. <gasps> oh, I could have a flower in my hair. I think I might go for black hair instead then, so that the flower stands out a little bit more. Oh, I've got some pre-makeup sets. All right, let's just go for the first one. That'll do. Tattoos. Okay, I think I'm done. Aspiration, romance, obviously. Uh, we'll just stick with the default of cancer. That is my sign, so we may as well stick to it. And we will name her Shall I? Uh, we'll keep newbie because I can't be fucked to think of a new name. Okay, Shall I? Let's go. Do you want to save? Yes. Okay. I wonder if we're moving in with our mum or moving in alone or with a roommate. So I guess we're moving into our first home. I wonder who we'll be living with. Will mum make a return perhaps? Control your sims, interact with other objects. Okay, okay, fine. Okay, so it's slightly different to the sims buster now in that I'm controlling my sims movement with the analog stick. So that's gonna take some getting used to. Okay, these are my needs, all good. I got zero skills, and I think maybe these are my wants and fears. Well, I'm currently on storyline mode, so I'm just gonna put two and two together and assume that I need to clean up all the mess here. Oh, it's definitely gonna take some getting used to. I'm not used to moving my sim around with an analog stick. I'm used to saying trash, pick up, and then leave it for my sim to do. But instead, she picks it up, and then I take her to the trash can, and then she puts it in. And there doesn't seem to be if I press start. Oh, okay, here are my goals. Okay, okay. So I guess my goals are just my wants, my fears, my aspiration. Okay, progress. Well, I've completed 2% of the game already, apparently. Do you know what? I really don't remember this game at all. I know I played it at the time. I even had the little, um, the little game guide book thing to go with it. None of this scene here is bringing back any memories. When I played the Bustin, when I played Bustin Out for the first time, I immediately remembered the game. It all came flooding back. This one, not really. Okay, well, one of my wants is to take a shower. So, take a shower, girl. Get in there. Although your shower need is fine. You having a good time in there? Each sim has eight needs. Yeah. She also wants to use the trampoline. It's definitely weird not being able to move the cursor around. Oh, I don't have any money. Go and have a jump on the trampoline, girl. Get it done, girl. So I'm guessing then that the storyline... Oh, the controller's vibrating. I'm guessing then that the storyline is just to complete these wants. Congratulations, your sim has fulfilled a want. She wants to meet someone new. All right, well, I'm sure we can figure out how to do that. Oh, your housemates are returning home. Oh, I have housemates. What's up, bitches? Oh, I remember, okay, something's come back. This sim, this girl here, I remember her very well. Oh, my option are to slap, talk, and threaten. I guess because we're not very good friends. <laughs> um, draw portrait, okay. 
see how that goes. I'm curious to see what um, social level equates friends, because usually it's like 50, or in some of the games it's 40. Bi oh, build over 40 relationship points, okay. Well, we went down a little bit from drawing that portrait, so I'm guessing we didn't draw the most flattering picture. So I guess the only thing we can do is just talk. Compliment? Will that go down well? Or are we just not friendly enough for... Oh no, that did not go down well. Minus five? God. Okay, well then I don't really have any choice. I'm just gonna have to keep talking and talking and talking till we get to level 40 then, I guess. I can tell a joke, but with this chick, I, I just don't know where the land lies. I mean, look at the look on her face. She's scowling at me. Okay, what if I try telling a joke? I'm sure I'm funny. Okay, that went down well. That went down very well. And that got me a big boost in friendship. Sock puppet, maybe? Too, too far for a sock puppet? Oh, she's loving it. She's, she's doing it back. Okay, this should hopefully get us over 40. Yes, your sim has made a new friend. Oh, okay, bye-bye. Hit on. No, we'll, we'll end that there. Bye-bye. Okay, before I fulfill your needs, let's just take another look at what your little goals are. Get a new crush, kiss a sim, use talk on another sim. Maybe I'll talk to this one, Ozzy or Ossie. We'll just talk. Again, he looks pissed off. He looks pretty angry with me already. I need to start building some skills, really. I'll fulfill my needs, but I need to learn how to, um, how to cook. Because right now I can't cook for shit. Oh, a new object is available in the buy catalogue. Great, great. <gasps> I now have 2,000 simoleons to spend. Oh, shut up. Well, I don't see a bookcase around here. It's really annoying that I can't just move a cursor around to see my surroundings, but fine, fine. See if I can get myself a bookcase. Do I even have a bedroom? Are these rooms all furnished? Yeah, they all have beds in them. Okay, that's good, that's good. Oh, she wants a single bed worth at least 50 simoleons. Okay, we'll take this room. Overbuilding may put you in violation of the fire code. Remember, the fire code exists for your safety. So I have too much stuff. Is that what you're saying? Oh, and there we go. Okay, perfect. Oh, I've unlocked a new location. <gasps> right, well, I still have stuff to do though. I need to go and get some sleep because I am tired. Then we'll have some food, we'll take a shit, and then maybe we'll see what this this place is all about that the taxi rank has taken me to. Okay, she seems well rested. Let's go and take a quick shit, and then we'll get some food, and then we'll see what's going on at this taxi rank. <laughs> on the toilet, read magazine or play game. She wants to get a new lover. It's gonna have to be someone new, because you can't shit where you eat. Uh, get snack. Otherwise, I'll just make a fire, won't I, because I've got no cooking skills. My housemates are going to love me if I just leave my shit all over the floor, my wrappers. Maybe we'll just have another snack. Alright, let's check out this taxi rank. Is this it over here? This has got to be it, surely. Move location, shoreline trails. Okay, so I guess a cab is going to come pick me up. I have no idea what this place is. Maybe it's a bar or a park or a shopping centre. Is it a beach? Huh, I guess we live near the beach, near the coast. Oh, look at me just taking it all in. The little flower in my hair. All Sims need some money to buy food and money is to get a job. Oh, why are you telling me that now that I'm here? Is this where I live now? Is this my new house? I'm so confused. Have I actually just moved house? Oh, I can do a boogie board. I'm probably gonna fall flat on my ass because I've got no fitness skill. But you know what? We'll take, we'll take it for a spin. We'll have a look. I am a bit confused um, as to where I actually live. Oh. My uh, controller's vibrating a lot. I expect it will probably up the ante when I inevitably fall off this fucker. Yep, yep, just waiting for it to happen. She oh, actually, she's kind of a natural, isn't she? I am no longer gaining fun from surfing. <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right, well, your needs are pretty good. You're a bit hungry, but other than that, you're fine. So is this a community lot? Or is this somewhere that I can live? I mean, there's beds in here. Let's talk to Timmy. Hey, Timmy. He looks like he's into surfing. Uh, we'll just talk, have a little chit chat, see how he's doing. I think he likes me. All right, that's enough socializing for now. Um, let's see, I could answer the phone. Anyone interesting? Your frivolous lawsuit has been settled out of court. You win 100 simoleons. 
Oh yeah, I am in the money. Well, I don't see a newspaper around here, so I think this is just somewhere for visiting. If I click on this, does it say go home? No, it just says move location. Well, I've just bought a bookcase in the other house, so let's just go there for now. Just see what the situation is. Here's my cab. Okay, chalet. We're back at base. I kind of feel like maybe I am supposed to live in that second location. It just seemed so quick. But then thinking about it, I suppose I moved out of mum's house pretty quickly and busting out. So I'm just going to hang around here for a minute and see if I can gain a skill. She's currently grabbing a book though, so I don't know if... Oh, here we go. Okay, study cooking. Just get... Try and get at least one skill point. Let's start there, because I'm pretty sure my goals, which are now categorised as wants and fears, one of them's going to be to gain a skill point, isn't it? Get a new lover, get a crush, kiss a sim, find a job. Well, let's just stay here for long enough to get a skill point then. And then we'll go back to our new home and see if we can find a job. I just want her to have at least one cooking skill point so that I know that we're not going to start a fire. Oh, you've learned a new recipe. <gasps> cool. All right, let's give that up. Come on, Shelley. Oh, have I learned two recipes? Right, Shelley. Put down, put the book down, just stick it on the floor, no one cares. And let's go back to our new home. I guess level one was a pretty easy one, so let's go to Shoreline Trails. We'll find a job, we'll fill your needs, and then we'll start working on your, uh, your love life, Shelley. You saucy minx. Okay, so we are quite hungry, so let's start off with some grub. Where's the kitchen? Get ingredients? Welcome to the food creation system. By combining up to four ingredients, Sims can create custom meals. Oh, I kind of remember this, actually. Oh, yeah, this is coming back now. All right, we'll do some chicken. Um, some onion, some oil, and maybe some... God, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Um, some... Oh, I don't have access to these. Okay, all oh, right, they're greyed out. I see, I see, I see. Okay. Uh, well then, let's just go potato then. Done. Let's see what we've made. What did we come up with? Now that you have your ingredients, you can eat them raw, prepare them on a counter, use a stove, um, may prepare a sliced roast. Gain yourself some skill doing that, girl. Oh, I'm glad she's actually building the cooking skill whilst cooking, that's handy. Um, it's a lot more like step-by-step, step, this game. A lot more hands-on. And a lot more jerky. You've made sliced rose. This will satisfy... Oh, good good hunger. But it'll make me shit myself straight after. Well, that's fine. Um, eat the food. Just look at the food. That would just be cruel. Eat the food. What the fuck happened here? Did you, like, piss yourself? What happened on the floor? Animal. Okay. I keep pausing the game to move the cursor around, forgetting that I can't do that. I have to control her. Is there a phone around here? Yes. Well, let's... I guess we'll answer it. I was going to hire a maid, actually. Well, whoever she's talking to has pissed her off. Services, maid. Yes, please. We need one of those. All right, maid, done. Thanks, Chalet. Someone will be over today. Oh, thanks, Mayday. Okay, where's the toilet? Over here. Okay, take a shit. I'm surprised it hasn't come up with options when I click on the toilet to say number one or number two. Why don't you read a magazine if you're going to be there a while? Yeah, there we go, just like that. <laughs> Enjoy. Enjoy your dump. I learned a new recipe while taking a shit. Oh, amazing. Right, Chalet, you desperately need to go to bed. So we'll go get some sleep so that we are well rested to find ourselves a job in the morning. Well, it is the morning. In the evening. Oh, I can switch control here. You switch to a different sim. Well, she seems pretty happy, this one. How's she doing in... She's got level 3 cooking skill, that's handy. I might get you to cook my meals from now on. Back to me, though, the, most, the star of the show. The only annoying thing about this is that time doesn't go by quickly while I'm sleeping because I already have another sim. Right, come on, you. I'm going to send you to bed so time goes by a bit quicker. Go and get some sleep. Oh, yeah, that's better. Time is zooming past now. That's what we want. Both up at the same time. You're so in sync. All right, Shelley, you slag, let's go find ourselves a job and then we'll take a shower and then we'll have some food. Now, if I remember correctly, there should be a job available in the fashion industry. And as a lady who has a passion for fashion, 
That is where I want my career to be. Find a job. If there isn't one in the fashion industry, then we're going to take a day and look again. I want to be America's next top model. Art career for a nude model. No thanks. Athletic. No. Come on, they only give you three options, so this next one's got to be fashion. Ah, oh, politics! Shelley, you've looked through all the job listings. Fine, just set it down. Let's just go take a shower, get some food. Maybe we'll try and make friends with the guy that we're supposed to make friends with. Timmy. That's it. Chalet and Timmy. That's got a ring to it, that does, you know. Oh, look, there's my little friend at the door. My friend I care about so much, I didn't even remember her name. What is it, like Allegra? I don't know. Does it show me my friends? It shows me my wants and fears. It shows me my skills. It doesn't show me my friends. I have to go into the bloody game menu to find my friends. Felicity, that's right, Felicity. Yeah, I'm friends with Felicity. Not quite friends with Timmy, but we'll get there, Tim Tim. All right, Chalet, you slag, let's go get some food. Why won't it let me interact with the fridge? Yeah, fridge. Um, get generic ingredients, okay, yes. Save me the hassle. I don't want to learn something new every day. Make shabu shabu. Looks tasty and well prepared. Okay, well, on that note, um, I think this episode was mainly just about finding our feet. So I'm going to end this one here. And then in the next episode, let's see how we get on with our, um, our second location goal, shall we? Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.